Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. Today I'm going to be showing how to hopefully resolve um, a web page error you might be getting in Mozilla Firefox. Specifically, it might say you have an unresponsive script, or a script might be busy, or it might stop working. You can stop the script now, or you can open it up, or you can debug it. So, in this brief tutorial, I'll be showing you how to hopefully resolve this issue for you guys fairly quickly. So we're going to start first by opening up the Firefox web browser. Doesn't matter how you open it up, we just have to get to it. So I'm going to blow this thing up full screen here. And now in the address bar I'm going to type about and then I'm going to do a colon config. So it should all be one word about colon config and then I'm going to hit enter on my keyboard might get this little notice saying this might void your warranty left click on I accept the risk so you want to type flash into the search menu so in this list you should see where it says dom.ipcplugins.flash.disable protected mode if it's set to false we want to make it true we can do this by double clicking on it once the value is set to true, you can close out of the web browser. Try reopening it. If you're still having issues, there's one further step we can go into. And we're about to do that right now. So again, if the first method did not work for you guys, what I would suggest is head back over to the menu icon in the top right corner of your screen. And then left click on the little question mark button here. And then left click on troubleshooting information right here. And then underneath, give Firefox a tune-up in the top right, left-click on Refresh Firefox. Please note that refreshing Firefox will remove your add-ons and customizations, as well as restoring your browser settings to defaults. So just take note of whatever add-ons you might have installed on your web browser. For most people, there's only a couple, so it shouldn't be that big of a deal, honestly, to sync them back up. It shouldn't take more than a couple minutes. If you have a lot of add-ons, you might want to consider slimming down a little bit on that if they're not necessary because they're probably really slowing down your browser and could be giving you problems all on their own but regardless we're gonna continue on and we're gonna left click on refresh Firefox here so this will begin to refresh Firefox it will take a moment but in my case it was pretty quick so it says the following items were refreshed doesn't even give you a chance to read it that's how quick it is and we can see that our browser has started back up and we can also see that a new folder has been created on our desktop that says old Firefox data. So we open that up. We see different bookmarks we might have had. We extensions we might have had as well. So there's different information we can get from this as well. But for the gist of everything, I hope this brief tutorial helped you guys out. And I will catch you in the next tutorial. Goodbye.